Hello Tech World and welcome back to another video. Today we'll be looking at the Xiaomi Pad 6 which may be one of my favorite tablets to come out in 2023 but today I'll be letting you know why this is still a great tablet to buy in 2024. It's a great tablet that comes with amazing features and what's great about it is the fact that this tablet will not break the bank. Don't get me wrong, this tablet is not perfect by any means, but it still packs a punch at an affordable price. If you're new to the channel, we cover everything tech and gaming, so make sure you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any future videos. Now let's get back to the tablet. When it comes to the unboxing, inside the box you get the Pad 6, a quick start guide as well as the 33 watt fast charging adapter as well as a USB-C to USB-C charging cable and again a manual that most people don't tend to look at. When it comes to the Xiaomi Pad 6 you can get this in four different colors. You can either get this in gold, champagne, gravity gray, and mist blue. Now the one I decided to go with is the really weird but it's supposed to be the gold color but if I'm being honest this doesn't look gold at all let me know down in the comments if you see any gold throughout this video now let's get to the display this display comes with an 11 inch 2.8k ips lcd screen which in my opinion looks great as it comes with a bright vibrant and an extremely fast 144 hertz refresh rate display the fact that this tablet comes with an 144 hertz refresh rate is astounding if i do say so myself as someone who owns a flagship Galaxy Tab S9, I can say the fact that the Xiaomi Pad 6 has a higher refresh rate at a, such a lower price is something that I love to see. Now, don't get me wrong, the difference between 144Hz and 120Hz, in my opinion, is very small, so it doesn't feel like you're missing out on anything groundbreaking. As stated before, this is an IPS LCD screen and it's not OLED, but I have to admit, it's still very good when it comes to watching shows, movies, or when gaming. When it comes to the screen brightness, this display does not get extremely bright as it is coming with a screen brightness of up to 550 nits. But as someone who tends to use his tablet indoors, this is not really a concern for me. When it comes to the processor, my Xiaomi Pad 6 is rocking a Snapdragon 870 with 6GB of RAM and 120GB of storage. Now the version I meant to order from Amazon was the 8GB of RAM and the 128GB of storage, but that's a mistake I'll just have to deal with. In regards to the power, this processor has plenty of power for gaming, multitasking, and more. Though the chip has been out for a few years now, it still has plenty of power for a casual user. If you're someone looking for a great tablet that does well with gaming, content consumption, and writing papers and more, well, this will definitely get the job done for you. For those looking for a tablet that can edit videos or photos, I look for more of a flagship device. In terms of battery, the Xiaomi Pad 6 includes a 8840 milliamp hour battery that supports fast charging. In regards to its battery life, I'm able to use this tablet for a day or two without needing to charge it. Again, it all depends on whether or not you're a heavy user, but in my experience, I'm able to watch videos, surf the web, as well as play Genshin Impact without ever worrying about needing to charge this device. I'm able to get around 10 hours of on-screen time, which I think, in my opinion, is very good. Moving on, let's talk about the speakers. As for the speakers on this device, the Xiaomi Pad 6 comes with a quad speaker setup, which also comes with Dolby Atmos, which is a great addition. In terms of sound quality, these speakers get really loud and do have some bass to them. Are they the best speakers I've ever heard from a tablet? No. But that doesn't take away from the fact that these are some great sounding speakers and definitely sound high quality, if I do say so myself. With quad speakers, you're definitely getting audio from all four sides, which definitely gives you that immersive feeling when watching shows, movies, or playing games. Here's a quick sample of the audio you get from this tablet when it's on full blast. Let's talk about the software experience. Straight out of the box, the Xiaomi Pad 6 is running Android 13 as well as MIUI 14. When it comes to the software on this device, you have things such as floating windows, side by side, in regards to multitasking. In terms of the cameras, on the back there is a single 13 megapixel f2.2 camera, which supports up to 4K 30 FPS. There is also an 8 megapixel ultra wide front facing camera. If you saw my review on the Samsung Galaxy Tab S9, then you know I'm not someone who 
tends to care for the cameras on tablets, but if you are, I can say that it looks pretty decent in my opinion. Now, I've said a lot of great things about this tablet, but there are a few cons that may be a deal breaker for you when it comes to purchasing this device. As mentioned earlier in the video, this tablet does not come with an OLED screen. It does not come with a micro SD slot for additional storage. There is no 5G or LTE option. There's also no fingerprint reader, headphone jack, or water resistance. Now, these are all features that you know you can get in more flagship devices such as the Galaxy Tab S9. But again, you have to be willing to pay the price for something of that premium feel. Now, in all honesty, I think Xiaomi did a great job with cutting these features out. The only feature for this price range in which I would have loved to see is a micro SD slot for additional storage. All in all, this is a great device that I feel as though most would love. At this price range of $350, you cannot find a better tablet in the market. It has a good battery, a great display, solid speakers, and more. The Xiaomi Pad 6 is a great buy in 2024, and you'd be foolish not to consider this device. As always, Tech World, it's been a pleasure, and I'll catch you guys on the next video.